basketball struggled at the start of last season, starting 0-8 in league competition. But down the stretch, the Raiders went 3-3, three and, three, and as the eighth seed in the tournament, they upset top-seeded Army to advance to the semifinals. The strong ending has to have third-year head coach Nikki Hayes-Fort itching for this season to start. And she joins me now via Skype to talk about it. Hi, Coach. How are you? Good. How are you, Melanie? Good, thanks. So as I mentioned, your team was able to turn it around at the end of the season. How important was that for your returning starters to gather that momentum heading into this year? Uh, it was very important for our program, for our returners. It was actually really important for our seniors to go out like that as well. So we're just trying to build on that and try not to be a one-hit wonder. You lose your top scorer from the last couple of seasons in Jasmine Lynch, but the next three in line from last year, Missy Rapoli, Josie Stockhill, and Mariah Jones all return. How big is that for your squad? Oh, it's huge for our team right now. It's just like they have a little bit more confidence, you know, going into practice. They just have, they, they know that we have multiple scorers on the floor. We're going to miss Jasmine, definitely, just her ability to score in bunches. But uh, we're, hopefully now we're just a little bit more evened out and we'll have just more scoring threats. You also return Lauren Cobiella, who led the team with 107 assists. What did you see from her last season, and how important of a role does she play in your offense? Lauren really stepped up her game, um, her leadership skills on, on and off the court. You know, she was able to be that, that second coach on the floor that we really needed. You know, she just had such a huge amount of confidence going down the stretch into the season, and she was a big reason why we were able to, to win some games late. Missy Rapoli, Mariah Jones, and Katherine Lewis were all strong from beyond the arc last season. How nice is it to have several go-to threats from the three? Well, we shoot threes every day in practice. We shoot a lot of threes every day in practice, and not just those three players. Um, you know, we want to be known as you know a high-scoring team. And obviously, with Missy, Mariah, and Catherine Lewis, we were able to uh, connect on several attempts. So this year, we're looking to you know take those three and just keep increasing the amount of threes we can make, probably the amount of threes that we take, and that more people to get involved. Are there any newcomers who you believe will be able to make an impact this season for your team? Yeah, we have three exciting players. Uh, we have Katie Curtis from Indiana, uh, Jackie Hudapal from California, and Steph Poland from Ohio. And all three are, are, you know, show very, very promising steps, you know, during practice. And we just need to, them to keep learning and growing and be able to contribute this year. You're entering your third year at Colgate. Can you talk about what it's been like building this program? Yeah, I really can't believe it's been three years. Um, it feels like just yesterday that we. We started this journey here with our program and kind of just the, the changing of the culture. And we really feel like we've done that. And and now just starting practice, you feel like a little different type of atmosphere. You feel like there's a the buy-in is there. Um, you know, you don't have to repeat yourself so much. You know the players are working towards the same goals. Their goals are different now than they were when I first got here. And that's exciting for me as a coach. That's exciting for our, our upperclassmen. And I think it's exciting for our freshmen to come in and just kind of feel you know, like this, this difference in the program and, and feel a change happening. And how are you feeling heading into this season? Because you've got to be excited, too, with all the momentum from last year. Yeah, I mean, it's that Army win was great for our program, and that's what I keep telling myself. It was really great for our program. It was really great for our seniors to go out with that great win at Army. A um, little disappointing ending, obviously, but we just had that great win. And, you know, I, I feel great about – the direction of our program right now. I feel I feel really good about our leadership on our team. I feel good about our freshmen and just how everyone came back. Everyone came back ready to go. I wasn't I didn't have to worry about anyone over the summer. You know, everyone's just working towards the same goals and we're really looking to, to take our team to another level this year. Well coach, good luck this season. It's been great chatting with you. Oh thanks so much. Go Gate.